as heck yeah, man. Huge congrats to Adam Ball Z as well, too. This man just ridiculous out there. The year of the flex never ended. It really didn't. There we go. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back today, guys, to the channel. Here back for another run at the LA Canyons. We're here doing the traffic two-way section for today. We have 42 kilometers of road to drive through, and we have a brand new car pack that just got released a couple days ago, the ACDFR pack. This had a lot of different drift cars in here. Today, we're gonna be focusing on two of them, the Ford Mustang RTR version, which is actually Adam LZ's newest paint for Formula Drift, and we have a monstrous 800 horsepower V10 Viper to also drive for today. So I'm really excited to dive into today's episode. Huge thank you for coming around on today's Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 beta day today. I will be on it. Let me know if you guys are as well too, and uh, let me know how you're liking it here, man. Huge thanks for watching, and of course, before we start, dad joke of the day coming from Sid Michaels. He goes, dad joke, you hear about the two antennas getting married, the wedding was amazing, but the reception was crap. When tennis still can't make it work out there, that sucks, man. Huge thanks for watching. Leave your dad jokes down below. And of course, don't forget to sub the like button. Alright, here we go, man. This is actually crazy timing because Adam LZ just posted on his Instagram that he was in the Utah mountains throwing this thing around as well, too. So we're in the LA Canyons for today. Same, same, but different, right? So this should be quite fun. And of course, we have the full traffic set up here for today just send it in oh just a tap How quick little peel back here excuse me everybody excuse me everybody okay yeah really there we go yeah this is so sick to see this on here i've been oh okay yep we're gonna go that way that's not a problem jeez i haven't seen an adam lz paint like this actually for a long time. Uh, I don't think there was any good AutoZone paint jobs on here, so we finally got one, and it looks so good. Look at this. Heck yeah, man. Huge congrats to Adam LZ as well, too. This man just ridiculous out there. The year of the flex never ended. It really didn't. There we go. Yep. Oh, it sounds so good. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, hidden springs back there. This car does look so good though. Let's see if we have any extra options. I don't know if we do or not. Uh, tur oh, we have actual turbo too though, okay. Adjustable. Was not expecting that. No, we can't pop the hood? Shit. Ooh. It's fast. Big handbrakes. Jeez, I thought for sure I was dropping that man. I am excited to drive that Viper though as well. As you guys know, I'm a big Viper fan. Ooh. No, no. Yep. Oh, just too much angle on this damn thing. Okay, let's see what we got here for a little cockpit view. Oh my goodness. It's a handful though, I'll tell you that. We're only at 50 PSI on the damn turbo. Right? We're only at 50% on the turbo. Not 50 PSI, sorry. My bad. Oh, that's... The Big Pines going left and then LA to the right here. So we're going to go to Big Pines. Let's see how we do. Hopefully these guys do not hit me. Just trying to have some fun today. We're in the fun haver, right? Come on now. Oh, jeez. Not this much fun. Holy. All right, let's see what we have for F6 views here. Hope it... Oh, nice. We do have the damn roof here. One of my favorites for sure. I can make it. I wasn't a hundred percent. I thought I was right, but you can't be certain. This little guy making it the little damn delivery. You really got to make sure you're gonna be okay on the extension because some of these are a little bit longer or shorter. Yeah, he almost went right off the damn road. Is he okay? We're gonna just file in, file in. We're gonna hop back to the F6 views. What else we got? We got the wheel view. That looks pretty cool. Carbon fiber everywhere. Holy. We got a rear view. That's super cool. What is that on the on that strip? And then we got the okay, we're gonna stay in this top of the damn roof view here. 
Oh, imagine seeing this thing that just got ripped by your door. But I will say, though, it would be super cool, though. Obviously, I, right, he just got all those new cars for the car week. He's got the CRX now, which he might be using for a guest car. But it would be really awesome to see all those make it into a set with a new car pack. That would be super cool. An Adibal Z car pack. The man has how many cars now? He has so many cars. Oh. No. Now, for whatever reason you guys don't know who Adam Z is, I will leave a link to his YouTube channel down below, but I'm pretty certain, I think anybody who has a YouTube account knows who Adam Z is. If you don't, right, I'd like to genuinely know down below in the comment section. And if you don't know who he is, go and look at OJ. Now, we're going one more time down this way here. And, of course, we haven't even got to 100% turbo here, so let's go ahead. Hondo P. Let's just see how we do. Pretty aggressive already. Oh my goodness. I got it. I got it. Jeez. It's very, very uh, slippery on the rear end there. I didn't I didn't check the tuning as well too. I forgot again. Nice easy throw with it. Oh, taxi! Oh! Before we go any further here, let's go ahead and take a look at the gear here. Let's see. We actually have six gears. I was not expecting that. And they are quite long already, but we can actually, we can, we can lengthen these gears even more, which I'm going to do. I don't know how that's going to feel or not, but we'll find out. We only have actually one set of tires. Interesting. But they are jacked up here, so we're going to bring them down to about 15 PSI. Just to see how that grip feels on the car. And let's try it. If you guys have another car in the car pack that you'd like to see done, let me know in the comment section down below. I will do a little pop up here of what's actually in the pack. And there's quite a few cars actually. I think there's like eight or nine cars in there. And I also recently found out on Twitter that there's drag racing servers on there. I could not believe it. And I actually had Orlando Edits uh, hitting me up on Twitter about that. So he actually has those servers and he sent me some screenshots of the cars that are in them. They look ridiculous, man. So I'm really excited to get my hands on some of those and actually drive on those servers. If you guys are a part of those drag racing servers, let me know in the comment section down below. And I'm just going to swing this camera around until we get that perfect camera that I'm looking for here, hopefully. One, yeah, three, two. Oh, it's a little bit too low. We can also bring that up. Oh, look at that. Bang, bang. It looks a little stiff, but I kind of like it, though. Oh, thank you. Beating the heck out of this second gear. We have quite a bit of cars ahead of us here. Holy. Back into some third person. gonna squeeze in yeah thank you just part of you right I'm just right I'm just one of you guys that's all my good old formula drift car is all right let's take a little Woo. okay okay get that nice old hood pin right on the left there that's actually kind of good to see that you just gotta be nice and easy with this thing Car will treat you right. Ooh. Go around. No, we're not. We're going to go right into him. Oh, my God. Sorry. We're going to see if we can actually do a nice little run here. We haven't... We're going to be came close to completing a full lap on this damn map here. Stuff that into fourth gear. Here we go. Jeez. No. Oh. Always, man. I have no map option as well, too, so I can't even see where the heck the next corners are. And if you're thinking, Slime, you haven't memorized this? No, man, it's 35 kilometers. I don't even know where the streets around my house are, right? You're going to learn LA Canyons? I'm just kidding. Maybe if this was actually used a little bit more often in online. Oh. What I always see online, the exact same tracks every single night being run for drifting. I don't understand how people have not got bored of it. I really don't. It's the same line rock tracks, the same damn base track on here. Oh, no, no. Oh, boy. Yeah, I'm screwed. Yikes. Yeah, this car's been a lot of fun today. Let me know your thoughts down below on it. But uh, I think it's officially time, though. We're going to say goodbye and say hello to the V10 monster that's in this pack. Oh, yep. Yeah. Next level racing stickers on this. No way. That's super cool. I might mean turn around. I mean, little drift. Let's go. Heck yeah. Quick sip here on my coffee. Cheers to everybody that is watching here.
for today. Damn, this thing looks good. there for a sec. Jeez, we can get another 80% of juice out of this thing. Okay, let's boost it up to 50. Let's see how we do. Hopefully nobody coming on the on -ramp. Oh, yeah, no. One car, one car. We're good, we're good. Woo. Oh, man. Dodge Viper. Imagine one day. I mean, honestly... At this point, they're just unobtainable. I'm not going to be getting a Dodge Viper. Uh, the gas prices for one. This thing is a gas guzzler. Oh, jeez. Uh-huh. I'm good. Ray, and I did see that one recent video of that older guy that had the Dodge Viper, and he challenged a Honda at the light and just lost it and threw it right into a pole. Pretty sad stuff. Obviously, you know, when you own a car like that, you got to understand its power. We actually had more power in the Mustang, but the Viper though, kind of feels like we're have a little bit more. Maybe it's more torquey, and that's where it's kind of coming from. I'm assuming. This thing is quick though. It's two-way traffic. Gonna be complaining about it when I was the one who put it on there. A little bit. I'd probably have more traffic if I could, but I just don't know if it's gonna end up breaking my game or not. My game is quite heavily being pushed at the moment as it is just with this many traffic cars I feel like. I'm not lagging or anything, but I just never know if it's a 99 CPU or not anymore because I've disabled it. Just pulled old Brian O'Connor and just closed the laptop on the bib. Okay, there we go. Fixed up the cockpit view there. The lights on there were just crazy with the extra effects filter that I had on there. Oh, yeah, I couldn't see that. I couldn't see that. Okay, finally getting a nice little cockpit view here with this. Do we have lights on with this thing? Oh, it's driver names. Oops. Yeah, we do have lights on. I thought maybe it was going to turn on that damn screen there for me. Jeez, this Viper, not a lot of visibility in this thing. Oof. I don't really want to go too hard because, yeah, exactly side of the cliffs come up real fast. Jeez, this kind of reminds me of that one channel that I was watching the other day. I keep forgetting his name, but I will post a quick little screenshot of his channel. This guy lives in, I think, Germany, and uh, he's got a, quite the collection of cars, and he has a very high-powered Dodge Viper, and he took it for a drive in the hills, and this man was going through corners, whipping it around. Night is good. Kind of inspired me to grab this thing here for today as well and just kind of throw this thing around here. We got a little tunnel section. Heck yeah, we haven't done this yet. Uh huh. Jeez. Car's coming in quick. Of course, a challenger is. No! Alright, we got quite a bit coming up here in 35 kilometers an hour on these signs. Holy. Or no, I guess it would be miles, right? Since we're in the, we're in the California hills here. Ooh, yep. Jeez. Oh no, no, that's not what I wanted at all! Uh oh, is it gonna blow up? Oh, come on! Now, so if I have to compare the two cars, which one I like better, Adam Z's Mustang or the Dodge Viper, I think I gotta give it to the Viper. I know we have actually less horsepower, which is strange, because usually I like the cars that have more horsepower. But this one definitely felt a little bit more dialed in. Mind you, though, we did a little bit more tuning on this car. But, oh, as I do this. Yeah, cool, thanks. that right that little rattle at the end holy we have a snake in the day of dodge viper oh it sounds so good i forgot about going 100 and psi on there oh yeah this definitely there takes the cake from adam all z's damn mustang 
Oh, let's go! We are dialed in with this thing, feels like. Stop breaking out for you. Just stomping on this one here. Sounds so good. That is the, probably the best sounding. Oh, here we go. There's the fat P.O. I don't know how we didn't hit that man. Hopefully we don't hit that guy. Or whoever is in front of us here. Okay, let's just slow it down here. Slow it down. Yeah, hold on, sir. Do not hit me. There we go. A little bit harder to do it like this, but hey, what the heck? Why not? Right, but just going back to what I was saying earlier, though, I really do hope that we get more car packs of YouTuber cars. Which is actually slowly happening. We've had Animal Z cars come in. We've had TJ Hunt cars come in. Not as many. Uh, and then we even had Jim's car come in for the No Hezzy server. So if you guys would like to see those, let me know in the comment section down below. I really did enjoy this session here for today. Like I said, the NW2 they get live. So I want to get back to play. Let me know if you guys are rumping in. Oh my god. But a set of Corsa though here on the LA Canyons. Anything is possible on this game, man. I'm really excited for the drag servers as well too. So if you guys do want to see that, like I said, subscribe with post notifications. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. And if you'd like to see a full Call of Duty episode and maybe my best clips on the Xbox beta, let me know in the comment section down below. Slap that like button. I really do appreciate everyone's time here for today's episode. And I'll see you guys back here tomorrow on the channel. We're going for one more run here. No lift challenge. Oh boy, it's actually going to work there. Sick. Okay, we're topped out at 2.45. I'm throwing it. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.